Today, we're thinking about slopes. And many of us might think of that as an additional challenge to our landscape design. But planting plants in a slope and on flat ground is really basically the same. You just want to take a little maybe extra time watching your water as you think about your slope. So what I did in this area of my yard where the slope is fairly tough, I watched on a couple of days where we had hard rains. And what I was looking for was erosion. And if you see the surface of your soil eroding off, you'll want to do some more either with simple terracing or maybe some more serious engineering because you don't want the water rolling off that quickly and taking your topsoil away. Here in my property, erosion is not a problem, so I felt comfortable going ahead and adding some new plants to this area of my yard. So some of the plants that will do well include Bleeding Heart, which is a native to Virginia, Creeping Phlox, which is also a native. This is one of the cultivars that you can buy at the garden center. And then the last plant I have here today is a Coral Bell. I really enjoy Coral Bells because of their nice flowers early in spring, which help my bees. And then they'll also continue to flower even till hummingbirds come, and then they'll feed them as well. So I'm gonna plant this coral bell. Uh, I wanna be careful when I plant on the slope to keep the plant flat. I don't wanna angle it one way or the other. So I'm gonna pull this plant out of its pot. And I'm gonna look, oh, the hole is a little too deep. I'm kind of trying to average between this high part and this low part. So I need to put some soil back in. I'm working on getting the soil all around. And then one of the things that I like to do when I'm planting on a slope is add a little bit of this extra soil around, kind of as a berm to catch the water as it comes down the slope, when it rains, water the plant before it then moves on down the slope. So while slopes may seem like a challenge, uh, plants love them just like they like flat surfaces. So don't be afraid to add some new plants to your sloped areas of your yard.